हाय गाइस वेलकम वेलकम बैक टू आर चैनल आई होप यू गाइस आर डूइंग वेल सो आई जस्ट थॉट ऑफ मेकिंग अ वेरी इजी मेकअप लुक विथ वेरी मिनिमम प्रोडक्ट नॉट यूजिंग मच प्रोडक्ट सो दैट दी थिंग्स बिकम मोर इजियर एंड यू कैन कैरी दिस ऑन एवरी डे बेसिस सो अप्लाइंग एवरी डे फाउंडेशन एंड एवरीथिंग इट बिकम्स टू मच लेट्स बी वेरी रियल सो आई जस्ट थॉट ऑफ डूइंग अ वेरी बेसिक मेकअप वीडियो नो मच ग्लैम एंड विथ अ वेरी मिनिमम प्रोडक्ट सो आई जस्ट स्टार्ट माई बेस विद दिस मॉइस्चराइजर बाई पॉन्स इट इज एक्चुअली अ जेल मॉइस्चराइजर इट इज नॉट अ क्रीम बेस्ड मॉइस्चराइजर एंड आई रियली डू लाइक दिस मॉइस्चराइजर सो आई सो आई जस्ट टेक लिटल बट so again applying moisturizer is really important before you start makeup or on a daily basis so moisturizer and a sunscreen is really important after applying moisturizer i'll go with any of the lip balm which you have you can use any of the lip balm of your choice and once you apply moisturizer at least i would leave it for 30 40 seconds and after that uh, immediately i'll go with the sunscreen i'm using this lotus sunscreen again take a generous amount when you're applying sunscreen I'll take little bit more for my neck and ears. And again, leave this uh, for good at least one minute. Uh, don't immediately apply any other product. Yeah. So once you're done with your sunscreen, uh, so today, as I told, I'll not be using any foundation. so the alternative for foundation i'll be using a lakme 9 to 5 cc cream uh, this is in the shade 01 beige so again this will uh, lightly cover your darkness or spots which you have it on your face and it's really good uh, on a for a daily use purpose you don't have to every day use a foundation so what i'll take is uh, uh, do is uh, i'll take little bit of this uh, cc cream and apply it all over my face and neck and i'll just uh, blend this out with a damp sponge or you can use also use your makeup brush foundation brush for this to blend it out I'll also apply on my neck and also cover my ears off camera. Yeah, so once I'm done with my uh, CC cream, I'll just go with a compact powder and set it very lightly wherever I feel I get oily. So I'm just taking this uh, Maybelline uh, compact powder. So I'll just set it under my eyes because I have creasing. over there and towards my nose because i really get oily only toward my nose and sometimes towards my forehead so i'm just setting here and very lightly very lightly all towards around my face completely i'm not taking much powder again
So today I'll be using this uh, 3-in-1 Rene Fab Face uh, Diva. This is what I've thought to use so that it has a lipstick in it and also a blush and uh, also a eyeshadow. Yeah. So this is how it basically looks. It has a blush. This is for eye and this is for lips. It's three one, three in one, very easy to go. That is what I feel. Thought let's just use it in this video to see how it perform. So I'll firstly go with my eyes. So what I'll do is I'll just gender. I have uh, how this works is uh, it's like a bullet. You'll have to move it out. You'll have to pull this out from here. So I take this separately. If I want a blush, I'll just have to put this towards down and just gently push it up. This would be the blush. So I'll go with the eye first. But you have to be very careful. Uh, if you really mess up, so I just took this off little bit if I just messed up this would get crushed over there for sure yeah so I've already did once if you see the blush had already come out a little bit so what I'll do is I'll I'm not using any separate eye product I'll just use this stick which is a, which is very beautiful golden shade so what I'll do is I'll just apply here directly and you don't even need makeup like uh, brushes to blend it's super creamy will it crease out yeah I feel it would crease out so what I'll do is uh, I'm not using any brush from my pinky finger I'm just rubbing it it out see you can just see the shine that's it nothing much i mean that's fine for uh, everyday basis but uh, did i like this much uh, i think it's not that great but yeah it just gives you a bit of shine that's fine yeah, so next, uh, after that eyeshadow, which is there in the stick, let's go with the cheek blush. So I've already messed it up, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah, so I'll just apply it on my cheeks. Let's see how the color payoff is. And I don't know how pigmented it is. Again, it's super creamy. You can just rub it from your fingers. You don't even want a brush to use this. So do I suggest this product? Yeah, for all the college going girls, uh, this has a 3-in-1 usage lipstick and a blush and the eyeshadow. I think it's really good. The only problem which I had is uh, you might crush the product if you put it wrongly you have to be very careful and the other thing is uh, i was not happy with the eyeshadow like uh, pigmentation else it is fine i'll just put it a little more I mean, you can definitely see the color. Yeah. Little bit on my nose. Yeah. The last, yeah. I really like this blush which is being given uh, in this 3 in 1 combo. And lastly, we can go with the lipstick. Okay, and it's very good red color and 
it is definitely creamy for sure it is creamy so how long will it stay unless you're not eating something which is really oily or you're drinking something you're sipping something it would definitely stay definitely when you eat something oily uh, it would get come out from the between of your lips for sure so overall yeah i like this uh, rene fab face diva and how much i've paid i'll uh, i've paid somewhere around 300 350 i'm not sure what's the price i have given mrp says it's for 750 i took it on a sale on amazon so it was around 300 350 so is it worth it yeah you're getting a 3 in 1 thing lipstick and uh, blush and uh, eye shadow thing so i really like this lipstick and the blush not the eye shadow yeah you can just definitely give it a try would i buy it again i mean no i would not buy it again that's one thing let's quickly do a eyeliner so i'll just go with a normal little bit of winged liner i'm using this faces canada eyeliner yeah faces canada eyeliner which is in the in a pen format okay so i'll be looking down Yeah, I think this is fine. But you can definitely see the shine of that uh, cream eye shadow. Yeah. So I'll just little bit put it on my outer water line. Very little. I've applied. I'm not gonna fill my eyebrows. I feel it's fine. You don't have to fill it every time unless you really have those spaces in your hairline. I think it's really fine. Yeah. I think this is pretty enough for everyday basis. You don't have to go much. You can definitely skip on the uh, eye shadow which I've applied. I just wanted to try it out. which i have purchased that how it goes so that's the reason i just tried it out but you don't have to really do it and lastly i'll apply mascara i'll be using this uh, maybelline hyper curl mascara yeah done I'll just quickly do my hairs off camera. So I've done with my hairs and I've just put on the earring. Now again, you can uh, go with a nude lipstick if you want to. I just wanted to try this. So I've used the red one, which is there in this, but you can definitely go with the nude lip a uh, lipstick if you don't want such a bright lip. So overall, how many product have used apart from uh, the skincare, which is. Uh, moisturizer sunscreen i've just used one is this cc cream 3 in 1 lip cheek and uh, eye mascara and eyeliner that's it so i think it it would become very convenient you don't want much products on daily basis you can just do a very light makeup yeah i know in this look this lipstick is looking very bright you can definitely go with a lighter shade that is what i wanted to tell so i hope you like this video it's very easy very quick you don't need more than 5 to 7 minutes that is what i feel you don't need more than that yeah if if you have a problem in applying eyeliner you might need another 10 minutes that actually depends but yeah you hardly need 
five to seven minutes to just complete this look and it's very good come on now it's really good you don't need much products and uh everyday look kind of thing you can just tell you can just change the lip color and you're good to go if you want you can apply a very small bindi and yeah that's it you can tie your hairs you you can put pony so yeah this is the final look which i have created very simple just three steps nothing much so i hope you like the video and if you do like please do consider uh, subscribing to the channel it it really means a lot if you don't subscribe it's still fine if you're uh, happy with this video and if you learned something that is what i want to yeah so uh, keep doing well and uh, yeah that's it thank you so much thank you so much for watching this video bye